guys, Jordan here with Enix Skin Gaming, and today I'm doing a character review of Batgirl and Injustice iOS. So, Batgirl was the very first challenge, and she came out around about the end of April last year. Um, so, you can buy her in the shop for 192000 if you got her challenge. Um, so, there have been two Batgirl challenges, they've, they've done a repeat of it. And I think this is with support cards. I'm not sure if it's with or without. Um, it is 850 attack and 1,000 health. Are the st uh, basic, the base stats. Um, and her passive is called Tactical Advantage. Bad girl and her teammates each start the match with one bar of power, which is going to be helpful. And for 192,000 again. And taking a bit to load and random boost back opening. Bane, that sucks. Now going on to her card. I have her at level 50 Elite VII. Elite 7. Obviously because it's an ultimate hack file. Damage 33,277. Health 72,900. Support enhancement health. Support enhancements health. James Gordon, her dad. Commissioner Gordon, uh, attack, Sensei Dragon Cat, I think that's who trained Batgirl, and, oh, and energy is Birds of Prey, um, so that's just her team with Black Canary and other people, I think, I'm not quite sure, and the gear, I don't think Batgirl actually has a gear, but if she does, no one's ever found it, I don't think, um, so I've got Mutated Bone Spikes, Knife Metal Morning Star, and Powered Screamer Sticks. So the moves are First Art of Deception. Batgirl uses a smoke bomb to cover her as she attacks from a distance. Max damage uh, pretty much 22,000. Second move Redemption. Batgirl uses her exceptional agility to gain the upper hand. Over her opponent, max damage seven uh, sixty-five thousand eight hundred eighty-eight, and super move high wire act, blending death-defying acrobats with over overwhelming force. Batgirl smashes her uh, opposition unblockable, and damage eighty-two thousand. So that's less than the max damage of the second. No, it isn't. Oh, that's weird. I thought it was. Okay, so getting into a battle now with Crypto Lex Luthor and Regime Green Lantern. Okay, so got our first move here straight away. Art of Deception and Rapid Swipe. Nice stunned and then I'll just knock him out. Well, knocking him out pretty fast, but oh, but there's Containment Doomsday, so that doesn't really matter. He's going to be really hard. So I got my second move. I probably won't use it on Deathstroke. I'll use it on Doomsday right here. Second move, Redemption, Rapid Swipe again. And then, oh, I didn't see that, but we're supposed to do uh, one of those tap things when it gets to the middle. And I'm just going to let him hit me a couple of times. So, L Crypto Lex Luthor should give my whole team a 30% increase to the maximum health. And... Regime Green Lantern should give a energy boost. So here's the super move high wire act, I believe. Whoa, that looked like his head just went like, turned completely around from his body. Okay, so knocked him out there after three rebirths. And he's got bones coming out of his knees there. Got two challenge credits, which is great. Credits earned 1450 and that's always good. So I was supposed to be doing a uh, Injustice Gods Among Us 2 uh, theories video last night, but I couldn't think of eno enough theories, so it's probably going to be within the next two weeks. Um, within the next week, hopefully, if I can just think of enough theories. I'm not too big on DC Comics and all that, so it's going to be hard for me to think of theories, and I'm just going to have to go along with the Injustice PlayStation game, Xbox game, 
storyline. I'm gonna have to play through that again um, on my PS3 to figure out what the storyline is. So next week on in two days, I'm gonna be doing another character review after my Minecraft series. And it's probably going to be who's the second challenge? It's gonna probably gonna be General Zod, and then after that, one of the other challenges. I'm not too sure who. And then, yeah. So vote down below who you want. If you want me to do someone specific, if not, then I'll just do General Zod, and do it in order from then on. So that's gonna have to be it for the, this video. If you liked it, please be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. And as always, see you later.